Hello, this is Wampire. I'm here to explain the video that I just uploaded, which was um, me working on my Eskrima techniques on the punching bag. Okay, so uh, first things first, uh, I'm sorry I haven't been around uh, recently. It's because I've been doing a lot of real estate stuff. Um, I didn't think I'd be doing that again, but, but I am, and it takes up a lot of time. So I apologize for that, but there's not a day that I that goes by and I'm not thinking about uh, you know doing a video for you guys. So so anyway, uh, okay. So the first thing that I did was I grabbed uh, two Eskrima sticks and I was doing the Heaven Six and I was just focusing on grip really really hard and keeping my wrist rigid, completely rigid, locking it in and just going as fast as I can nonstop. And what that, what that does is that blows out the arms. I wanted to make my arms tired so that when I did go to the punching bag, um, I would have to use more body mechanics because my arms are already uh, worn out. So that was kind of the goal. I was trying to do that. So I was just going really, really hard, real rigid. And then, of course, just because it's so fun, I did put in a little bit of, you know, uh, uh, more flowy movements at the end, slightly at the end there. And then I put the sticks down put on the, my punching bag gloves on uh, the, the thin ones, put them on, and I started off with uh, the idea is to defang the snake. So I'm just going, bam, bam, two, two hits. So just constantly two hits, two hits, two hits. And the idea there is when they're swinging at me, I'm hitting the arm. So I'm trying to keep the distance, go in. So it's like a game of tag. Just go in, bam, bam, hit the two. Two hits, get out of there. And I don't care out of the two hits, only one hits, or if I miss, I don't care. It doesn't matter. But the idea is go in, go out, go in, go out. So I do that a little bit. That's kind of the entry. And then from there, I go into, um, I'm doing some boxing moves so that I get to see, you know, work on my body mechanics, work on my boxing, just pure Western boxing, uh, just to get some polish that up because, man, I, I got a lot of work to do there. And, and then from there, uh, I put in some of the Heaven Six movements to blend it in. And the idea is not because if I'm facing a boxer, I'm going to use Heaven Six on them. Because if I did at that medium range, they're going to win because they hit harder. If I'm doing this, Heaven Six, and they're going boom like this, I'm going to lose that. Okay, But the benefit for me is if I had a knife, because this is a slashing movement, it's not this, but this is a slashing movement, boom. The slashing movement will give me the advantage if I have a bladed weapon. So, uh, and, and for me, I intend to for self-defense and, and whatnot. So uh, I could make sure to keep practicing that. And I'm using the Heaven Six pretty much as an entry. So I'm not there to trade shots and see who can hit harder because once again, I will lose that match against the boxer. It's to do this. It's to go in. So I'm using the heaven six to as an entry. And that's why you'll see me using the crossed arms as an entry tool. So the heaven six crosses your arms. That's what it does. It Because of the slashing movement, it crosses your arms. And when it crosses your arms, now I have double shields to slam in elbows and forearms and even fists into the opponent. So I'm using that to go in. So you'll see me do a little bit of like elbow stuff going in as an entry. And then once I go in there, uh, now I'm using the heaven six differently. I'm using the heaven six in where, when the opponent's like right here and you'll see this kind of same, same motion, but the angles and, and the, uh, the movements are, are a little bit different. It's much, much tighter. So what I'm doing there is I'm basically using my fist, my whole hand, as a cheese grater on their face, on all the sensitive areas right here. So I'm, I'm doing this on their face. That's the idea there, is to get into close range and use the heaven six all over their face to get control because that'll disrupt their balance and whatnot. So they can't just land a really strong, powerful shot on me because they land that on the kidney, on the spleen, um, uh, liver, or uh, solar plexus, broach, and anywhere. They land one of those on me, big shot on me. 
it, it can end instantly. So, you know, I'm, I'm trying to get them as much as possible off balance, uh, throw them off their game. So that that's where that comes in. Uh, the attack the eyes and, and the sensitive area of the face using the, the what I what I'm very, very comfortable with, which is the heaven six, which is relentless. And uh, so so that's the idea there. And the other thing that I was trying to do in the video, practicing all that stuff put together, but also uh, the idea was to, uh, I wanted to last the whole video over three minutes. That was my goal. Yes, there's some time where I'm, I'm putting the gloves on so that that's taking away uh, a couple of seconds there. But I think the whole video came out to about four, four minutes, something. So, you know, just the double sticks and me working on the punching bag. I wanted it to be over three minutes and then uh, testing the cardio there with the O2 boss root and O2 trainer. So that's the main idea. It was, it was rough, you know, uh, surprisingly just having the camera there and, and knowing that you guys are going to be watching, it puts, it puts stress, you know, it, it, it does. And in real life, there's going to be even more stress. So that's, that's a good thing. You want to get used to that. And, uh, um, you, you just got to learn how to, how to deal with that and you, you want to make sure you have the cardio and, and that's, that's the ultimate is, is to make sure that my lungs don't go against me and, and hinder my performance. So it's up to me to make sure that my cardio is, is, uh, is decent or, or whatever. And, uh, yeah. So anyway, uh, that was the purpose. Uh, that's what I was doing on that video. Thank you for watching and take care folks.